I got a late start to the morning. I let myself sleep in because I worked the last three days. I worked Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Today's Thursday. Um, yeah, but I don't thank you. So I was only scheduled Wednesday and Thursday. I had a PTO day this week, but they were short on Monday. So I just picked up. I like working a three in a row. Stop chewing on this, please. Stop. Stop. I prefer working a three in a row because then I get a nice little stretch off. So now I'm off till Tuesday. Joey started his clinical rotations last week and I, it's just been quite, it's been an adjustment for sure. Got up, I made some breakfast slash lunch brunch, I guess. The rest of this morning, I've just been cleaning and starting some laundry. So today, I got some cleaning done, clean Todd's litter box. I still need to clean the kitchen. I'm gonna go to the gym, go ahead and get that out of the way for today too. Um, and then I have some errands that I need to run. I need to go to Sam's Club, because we've been out of paper towels. I like to get a huge, like the, almost like a hundred count box of tampons while I'm there. I like to get the big box of toothpaste too. So Joey's birthday was on Sunday. And he is so difficult to shop for. I bought him a set of figs, the scrubs, for his birthday. He was so difficult and just was telling me nothing that he wanted. The only thing that he really had talked about was a watch. But he is so picky. A watch is just not something that I could go pick out for him. Then I just decided, I was like, okay, well, I'll just take him shopping like on his actual birthday. So we went to Lenox Mall in Atlanta. He found absolutely nothing. I don't think that he was in, he's also one of those people he like very much needs to be in a shopping mood. He really has to like wake up and feel that way and I just don't think that he was feeling it that day. Um, which of course like made me sad because I wanted to do something for him for his birthday but he ended up finding nothing. We looked at watches for probably like 30 minutes. He tried on a bun. He's like, can you not bite my foot? Love you. The only thing that he wanted to do was go to the AT&T store and try and get a new phone. So that's what we ended up doing on his birthday, which is fine. As long as he's happy, I'm happy. It's not my birthday because I said, honestly, like this day is completely up to you. But I didn't end up getting him anything but the fig set for his birthday, which to him, he didn't care, you know. But for me, I am somebody that loves, I just love birthdays. I love my own birthday. I love other people's birthdays. We have a second bedroom in our apartment. It has his desk and computer set up, like his gaming set up in there. There is like bare minimum in there at the moment. There's like no decorations. We have a rug and we have, he's a painting of ASAP Rocky. So he also has music recording stuff in there. So I was like, okay, maybe he wants to like go along with the music themes. So I was like, what are your top six favorite music albums of all time? And so he told me, and I found this guy on Etsy that makes these like really, really cool like album posters. So I just ordered, like you can order physical posters from him, but you can also just order like the digital download. So that's what I did. I did six of them. I sent them all to CBS to get six, I think I did 16 by 20 posters. I'm gonna go to Hobby Lobby because they have 50% off frames right now. So I'll just go ahead and pick everything up, leave it all in my car, and then tomorrow while he's at the hospital, I'll go get it, put them all together, and just go ahead and hang them up in the room. And that way when he gets home, I can have them hung up in the room. Hi, I just got dressed. Figured I would just show you my outfit. Um, I'm wearing these gray leggings. I literally think they're from like Shein. Um, I'm wearing just a big oversized t-shirt with a big oversized sweatshirt over it because it's very cold. I'm also wearing my on clouds because I'll probably run at the gym today. I'm gonna clean the kitchen and then we will go to the gym.
got done with the gym. Parking decks that are under the ground, if I think about it too much, it really freaks me out. I don't know what it is about like the fact that I know right above me people are like driving their cars and there's a parking lot right above me. I don't know. <laughs> that just really freaks me out. We're gonna go to Sam's Club. <gasps> SOS. We're gonna go to Sam's Club. Uh, see what we find there and then run some more errands. Only in Atlanta is it taking me 15 minutes to go two and a half miles. I'm currently sitting in the Sam's Club parking lot just contemplating my life. I have to pee so bad. I hate peeing in public. I have no problem going to the bathroom when I'm at like a restaurant. When it comes to like going out shopping, like I don't want to use the Kroger bathroom. I will never use a Target bathroom. That's my um, dramatic situation for the day. Update, I just spent so much more than I meant to at Sam's Club because I have no self-control. Hi, I just went to Hobby Lobby and I am just like, I have issues. The reason that stores put snacks in the checkout aisle is for people like me. I need to go to Target too, which I wasn't gonna do today. I'm driving to this Hobby Lobby and there's a Target literally across the street. I'm probably gonna go to Target. I feel like this entire video has been just me in the car talking nonsense I'm trying to be laser focused in this target because if I am not I will stop and spend hours here uh, you don't want to see all the fun things I got oh we didn't need paper towels we have two um before you make dinner can you make me something else will you make me a chai tea latte no please no thank you no <laughs> I got lucky with the hangers because I needed those. I got a whole 80 pack of tampons. This is the toothpaste I got. And then I got these protein bars. And there's nine chocolate peanut butter and nine chocolate chip cookie dough. And I usually hate protein bars, but these I really like. Four bottles of wine. Some psycho. I got more mouthwash, giant pack, sparkling water, paper towels, big pack of hangers. I got Joey some shirts. I got this brave shirt just because it was so soft. And I got this little hoodie too, which is so soft. Hi, it is currently Friday. I think the last thing that I filmed was what I got from Sam's Club. The rest of the night, I just didn't film. We just were hanging out. I made dinner. Um, we had some salmon. I made these Brussels sprouts and I made them like super crispy because that's how I like my Brussels sprouts. And then when I took them out or I mixed them with um, honey and balsamic glaze. Oh, so good. They were so good. We just ate dinner and hung out last night so I didn't film anything. This morning I got up, made breakfast, had some coffee. Um, I've just been doing laundry and stuff on the computer. And now I'm about to run to CVS, I guess. I So I had to call them because I had placed that poster order and it was supposed to be, you know, a same day order pickup. And it still said in process this morning. And I was like, okay, well, it's not the same day anymore. So I called them and they said that they just never got the order. So I was so glad that I did call them because then I was able to like resubmit the order and now it's ready for pickup. So I'm gonna go get that. I'll come back putting together the posters and hopefully I can get it done, get them all hung up by the time Joey gets home from clinical. He texted me, he said, I actually just delivered a baby. I guess they don't really let students deliver babies um for obvious reasons 
And so sometimes they will let you just depending on the attending that you get. And I guess his just let him. Today is his last day um, in labor and delivery. He's still in his like OB GYN rotations, but um, he, this is his last day, like actually in the hospital for labor and delivery. So it's just cool that that was like what he got to do on his last day. And then I don't know what we're up to tonight. Um, we haven't decided anything. I think we may go get drinks or something somewhere. So keep you posted. I just thought I would show you my outfit before I leave. So I'm wearing this um, oversized sweatshirt. I just showed it uh, in the video yesterday. I literally just got it from Sam's Club. It is so soft and like lightweight. It's really nice. Um, then I'm just wearing plain black sweatpants. I'm wearing these um, Air Force Ones. And then my hat is Adidas. My earrings, um, I think they might all be from Amazon. The gold ones might be from Target, but the rest of them are definitely from Amazon. And then just my crossbody. We are gonna run out the door, run to CVS really quick. I'm sitting in our second bedroom. This is mainly Joey's room. We do have this couch that I'm sitting on. It's a pull-out couch, so technically it can be used as like a guest room. It's got Joey's desk with his monitors, his little gaming setup, and it's also where he does schoolwork and stuff too. So this is where I'm hanging up the posters because he's been dying for this room to look better. I'll literally show you. So. When you walk in the room, this is what we're working with here. I mean, that's, we have like old curtains sitting on that couch. That's the only thing on the wall is a painting of ASAP Rocky. That's, I moved that table right there to have a little setup for the camera and Tot's interested in it. And then he's got his like mic music set up um, and his monitor set up. So I have like two hours before he probably will be home. These are the posters. I'm so excited. They looked like they turned out so good. First thing I need to do is like actually get these all into frames. So I just got these poster frames from Hobby Lobby. It's Drake's Take Care album. And it's so cool. You can see like the, um, they put like all the song names on there too. And it's got Take Care Drake. And then it says like, it has like the release date and the label that released it. I don't know if you can see it and the length of the album too, which I just thought was really cool. I probably should vacuum in here before I do this. I can always tell when Joey was the last one to use the vacuum because of this mess. Oh my God, look at this. This looks so awesome. I'm gonna do the rest of them and then I'll update you when they're all done. Okay, we're still going. I've done three, I have three left. I'm taking a little breather because I'm hungry. And so I'm drinking one of these Fairlife, they're like the core power elite. It looks so good. I'm obsessed with it. That's the finished product. So you can see like with the desk right there, that's where it is. This was a great addition, I think. I am so excited to show him when he gets home. My plan is just to have him close his eyes and I'll walk him in here and show him. We're about to go to dinner. It's pouring rain outside. We're gonna go somewhere casual. Somewhere cat jewel. <laughs> We're gonna walk in the pouring rain and just bring umbrellas. I'm wearing the same thing I was wearing earlier, just with leggings instead. Same shoes. Show your fit. Gymshark, you already know. Okay, wish us luck. We're gonna walk to this place near Inman Park and eat dinner there. I've never been, but Joey has. He says it's good, so tell me how you liked your present. <laughs> it was cool. Best present ever. The best six pictures <laughs> that I could have imagined getting at the same time. Of Thanksgiving food for all of our cats. <laughs> I started with sweet potato. We'll go macaroni then. Green bean casserole. Perfect. Roll. Roll. Got our wine for our walk. Cheers.
<laughs> it's so windy. All right, good morning. It is now Saturday. Um, last night we went to dinner. It was like a nice chill bar. We just got like a couple drinks and played games and stuff. I think I got like maybe a couple clips. But now we're about to go to the gym and then go to breakfast. Babe, I need you to get her. I need you to get taught. It's so cold and so windy. Should we drive? Yeah, we are gonna drive. Oh, I was thinking we were gonna walk. Well, we're gonna go to the gym and probably go to, our gym yeah. is in Ponce. Oh. <laughs> our gym's in Ponce, so we'll probably go to um, a breakfast place called Pancake Social after. Joey's been, I've never been, that sounds good. You wanna show your fit, Joey? Show your fit, where's it from? <laughs> Nice. <laughs> you find anything? Update, we went to the gym, and then we went to Pancake Social, and it was like a 40 minute wait, which personally I didn't think was that bad. I did. But Mr. Picky over here wants to go somewhere else, so we're gonna try and find somewhere else. Um, a couple hours since I filmed so we went to um, this place called thumbs up diner if you're familiar with the area it's in Edgewood it's really good um, but anyways we went there and now we're about to go to Virginia Highlands is doing like this whole like day after st. Patrick's Day like block party so we're gonna go there because some of our friends like they have a bunch of the roads closed off and some of our friends lived on one of the blocked off roads and they're having like a big block party with like a DJ and stuff so we're gonna go there all right, so I'll show you what I'm wearing today. I'm wearing these green flare jeans from Zara. I can't remember what they're called. I have them in white too, but they're so comfy. And then I'm wearing just this white long sleeve from TJ Maxx, I think. Um, I'm wearing these lightning bolt earrings because I thought that would be fun. Um, I think I literally bought them for like Music Midtown a couple years ago. I think they're maybe from Shein. Um, and then we're just gonna throw on these just plain black boots. And then I'm gonna throw on this jacket too. It's just like a long, like fluffy trench coat situation from Shein because it's so cold outside and I'd like to be warm. Anyways, I'm just going to end it off here. So if you've watched, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.